fix Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands errors, crashes, performance issues, not starting step 1, make sure your computer meets the recommended Ghost Recon Wildlands system requirements for the open beta and final game, Ghost Recon Wildlands official minimum system requirements for 1280x720, low settings CPU, Intel Core i5-2400s at 2.5 GHz or equivalent GPU, NVIDIA GeForce GDX 660 slash GDX 750 Ti slash GDX 950 slash GDX 1050, 2 GB VRAM with shader model 5.0 or better, see supported list asterisk VRAM, 2 GB RAM, 6 GB OS, Windows 7 SP1, Windows 8.1, Windows 10, 64-bit versions only, HDD. 50 GB Free Space Ghost Recon Wildlands Official Recommended System Requirements for 1920x1080, High Settings CPU, Intel Core i7-3770 at 3.5 GHz GPU, GeForce GDX 1060 or GeForce GDX 970, 4 GB VRAM with shader model 5.0 or better, see supported list asterisk VRAM, 4 GB RAM, 8 GB OS, Windows 7 SP1, Windows 8.1, Windows 10, 64-bit versions only, HDD, 50 GB free space asterisk supported NVIDIA graphics cards at time of release, GeForce GDX 600 series, minimum, GeForce GDX 660 or better recommended, and slash A GeForce GDX 700 series, minimum, GeForce GDX 750 Ti or better recommended, and slash A GeForce GDX 900 series, minimum, GeForce GDX 950 or better recommended, GeForce GDX 970 or better GeForce GDX 10 series, minimum, any GeForce GDX 10 series card recommended, GeForce GDX 1060 or better gamepad support, Microsoft Xbox 360 Microsoft Xbox One, Original Slash Elite, PlayStation 4, Original Slash Pro, Steam Controller Other controllers may work. However they are not officially supported. They may require third-party software to work. Please contact the controller manufacturer for assistance. Examples include, any third-party Xbox-compatible controller Logitech Chillstream OUIA controller COP at http colon slash slash www.geforce.com slash what's hyphen new slash article slash ghost hyphen recon hyphen wildlands hyphen system hyphen requirements. Number 1 Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands crashes install on the same drive disable background applications open task manager and set the Recon process priority to normal. Refer to the below image. Disable SLE in NVIDIA control panel, if you are using it. Make sure a play launcher is current and, your GPU is compatible with the game. Number 2 Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands secondary screen bug If you are running a dual setup and your game launched on the secondary screen, try the below fix. Navigate to C colon backslash users backslash username backslash documents backslash my games backslash ghost recon wildlands back up the grw.ene file, then open the file in notepad this way. The line that contains output monitor and change its value into 0, 1, or 2 save the file and run the game number 3 Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands not starting run WTM to end Microsoft compatibility telemetry if you find that process. Close a play and start the game from Steam Library number 4 Tom Clancy's Ghost Re Wildlands Performance Issues Disable Said SLE Setting Optimize GPU Please Google how to do that. Get and install the latest official display and audio driver.